Hello folks, this is 2022, October, November, paper 13, and the question number is 36. The question is concerned with the chapter current density, as it can be seen here. It says three batteries and three identical resistors are connected in our circuit PQR. So PQR, we have got the three batteries here, batteries of different EMFs and three identical resistors. So let us say that the resistance is R, R and R. The batteries have a negligible inter-resistance, yeah, it's a given. What is the PD across the points P and Q? So we have to find VP here. In order to do that, let us first find the total current in the circuit. So what happens is, uh, this uh, source of EMF will try to force current in this direction. It will try to force current in this direction, and it will try to force current in this direction. But what we can assume here is, what you can see from here is, if I add this and this, this and this, the sum will be definitely more than this. So that's why overall the current will be in this direction. The overall current will be in this direction. So I will take this as the direction of current. So what I'll do is and apply and apply uh, course of laws. So it will be current here I. So it is force here current I. It will be force here current I, current I like this. The so current will flow in anti-clockwise direction. Now, we apply Kursov's law, which says that the summation of E is equal to summation of PD is here. So, this should be equal to, summation will be equal to 9.6, 9.6, this is opposing, so it is a minus 8.4, and this is supporting, so that is equal to plus 6.3, equal to the current into sum of the resistances so they are r plus r plus r sum of pds that's equal to i into sum of the resistances so from here i will obtain this whole thing is equal to uh, this is this becomes so uh, 8.9.6 minus 8.4 plus 6.3 it is 7.5 so 7.5 is equal to i into 3r so I becomes equal to 7.5 by 3R. So this is the value of the current here. Now we need the PD across the uh, terminal PQ. So it should be equal to. So this is uh, the source. This is R. And we need this is P. This is Q. So we need to find the PD across this VPQ. VPQ. So this should be equal to. This should be equal to. This is E here, E which is 9.6 volt. So this VPQ should be equal to, uh, VPQ is equal to E minus I into this R. This gives EMF, certain thing is lost in the form of VPQ and certain thing will be lost in term, in across this, this voltage. So that's why VPQ should be equal E minus this loss. So equal to, equal to, equal to, E is 9.6 minus I is 7.5 by 3R into this R. So R R gone. This is 9.6 minus 2.5. It will give us 651.927. So this is 7.1 volts here. So the correct answer will be correct. Answer C. Others are not correct.